If you can see, I'm saying that 100% of this is awesome. This is an excellent formula to know. If you're taking algebra, okay, pre-algebra, algebra one, college algebra, doesn't make a difference. Any sort of uh, algebra, you're going to want to know uh, this formula. It's going to come in so, so handy. And this is uh, my favorite way to find the equations of lines. But here is the bottom line, okay? When you uh, are asked to find the equation of a line in algebra, you need to have these two pieces of minimum information. You need to need, uh, know at least one point that is on the line. We have to have one point at a minimum, uh, know at least one point that's on that line, and we need to know the slope, okay? So remember, if you're asked to find the equation of a line, you need at a minimum uh, the slope of that line, and at least one point that's on that line. We want to find the equation of a line, okay, that has uh, a slope of 2, okay, and it goes to the point 1, 3. So I know I'm kind of, you know, being extra, extra redundant, but, uh, you know, I've been teaching this stuff for decades, and, you know, a lot of students don't make these uh, big picture connections. This is the point uh, slope formula. All right, I love this formula. It's super awesome. And uh, when we have information like this, we want to find the equation of a line, you should automatically think point slope formula. Okay, we have y minus 3 uh, is equal to 2 times x minus 1. Okay, I just showed you where these values come uh, from. But if you understand that, then this is now just basic algebra. So now I'm going to add 3 to both sides of the equation. And when I do that, I get y is equal to 2x plus 1, and I am done. So the answer is y equals 2x plus 1, which, of course, is in uh, slope-intercept form. So that's the whole idea behind using a point-slope formula. We're given some clues about a line. Hey, I know this line. I know it goes to the point 1, 3. I also know it has a slope of 2. What is the, the, its uh, equation? Find the equation of that line. We're talking y equals mx plus b. Well, if you use a point slope formula, okay, we get to the answer, y equals 2x plus 1.